The winding course of the Snake River traverses over 1,000 miles between Yellowstone National Park in Wyoming and the mighty Columbia River in Washington State. Between those two points, it flows through the open prairie country of southern Idaho, creating the Snake River Plain. A pair of steel rails originally laid down by the Oregon Short Line in 1884 continue to carry rail traffic through this fertile portion of the gem state. Welcome to Union Pacific's Nampa Sub. Running over 242 miles between Nampa and Pocatello, the Nampa subdivision is a key artery to the Pacific Northwest, seeing around 15 to 20 trains in a 24-hour period. Several manifest trains are routed over the subdivision, along with unit trains of soda ash and grain, in addition to high-priority intermodal trains on east-west runs. In our continuing series on Union Pacific's Idaho Mainline, we will cover the western portion of the Nampa subdivision between Nampa and Tequesca. We will see the Boise Valley Railroad working into Idaho's capital city. Watch trains passing giant remnants of the steam era. Battle the steep grade of Reverse Hill. Wind along the Snake River near Glens Ferry. And climb the Tequesca grade east of King Hill. Join us for Union Pacific's Idaho Mainline Part 2.